So there's been brand new Bigfoot evidence that actually has professionals scratching their heads and utterly baffled and it's pretty insane the footage that's captured. Bigfoot is an urban legend that has been around for as long as the Yeti, ghosts, werewolves and the like but unlike others there seems to be a bit more supposed Bigfoot evidence. Most is ultimately debunked, but the footage that we're about to take a look at even had some of the biggest professionals scratching their heads in awe. And that's what we're going to be taking a look at today because the footage, when I looked at it, I was like, oh, oh damn, this there could be something to this. So we're going to take a look together. We're going to dive into it and we're just going to see what we make of it. Um, but I warn you now, this could change everything. Could be in the operative word there. The first video is on a Instagram page Page called UFO UFOs Factory, sorry, and uh, they state one of the most important images in the world of cryptozoology. In 2022, Bigfoot's face was immortalized during the filming of a documentary. All right, this is the clip that came with it. Take a look at this. Filming of Sasquatch in another in another area where he's worked on, and with him explaining the background, which is so important. And uh, I'm firmly convinced that he has filmed Sasquatches and that he has interesting stuff let's take a look at it one more time but look at this segments of Todd Standings now that could be any type of animal of course I'm not really up to scratch with my animals so I don't know what it could possibly be but for it to have had this much of a reaction to the point where literally people were scratching their heads I've done some research on this clip and there are people who are backing this as the most legitimate, supposedly legitimate, Bigfoot evidence. Now, that got me on a bit of a, a, a black hole, if you will. Bigfoot footage. And I stumbled across some very, very interesting clips. Now, some of them have kind of been, can be explained away, but some of them really did leave me scratching my head. And I wanted to put it within this video, obviously, to um, not confirm the Bigfoot existence, because I don't think one video from me is going to do that but i think it can get us talking and get a good conversation going about bigfoot about the legitimacy of the clips and uh whether there is truly a sasquatch bigfoot whatever you want to call it out there so the next clip that i stumbled across comes from the tiktok page jason klein and the video uh comes from a youtuber that filmed something truly scary while mushroom hunting very interesting, but uh, again, don't judge before you see it. Let's take a little look. People are losing their minds over this video where someone is out hunting mushrooms in the forest. Now, as he is looking for these mushrooms in the forest, he's going to be looking down at a mushroom when all of a sudden he hears something crazy in the background. What do you guys think? What the heck is that? Let me know in the comments, follow for more. That is a very, very distinct sound. It's wide bark blood curdling, it's pretty terrifying, um, but it could be any name or array of animal. Um, I know foxes make a very strange howl-like sound, but never heard a fox make one like that. Uh, is it Bigfoot? <laughs> no, I can't say it is, but kind of unexplainable to a degree it's kind of weird kind of funky so i thought i'd include it in this video as well but the next one is actual footage but this one was actually on nine news so a legitimate news station from australia uh, as they supposedly have footage of a sasquatch caught on camera now this might actually rival that very first uh, video that we showed in terms of creepiness and potential legitimacy take a little look at this now what's interesting about this clip already is that when it squatted down if we take a little look back when it squats down it almost blends in with the grass so if it was actually squatted down to begin with this train would have kind of passed by without anyone really probably noticing it maybe that's just how it looks on camera maybe with the, the the raw eye you might it might look a little bit clearer but that's just what i see from it but take another little look at this as it squats down it just somewhat seems to disappear this was in colorado in the u.s so make of that what you will very interesting very 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 interesting um the people on the um the train seem baffled uh which kind of adds 
for me to the legitimacy of this clip it makes it almost more believable because the people on the in the clip aren't it doesn't seem pre-planned it doesn't seem they're not terrified but they're not um you know expecting it to happen it's almost like oh that's really weird what is that um again it could just be someone dressed up for all we know it could just be someone dressed up for shits and giggles uh going out onto a field just to kind of you know make a bit of a scene in front of some people but i don't know anyway the next clip um again is very very interesting it starts out with this uh clip right here which is actually so infamous in the uh bigfoot community i'm not part of it I, you know I, I kind of dip in and out i'm like oh bigfoot video i'll take a look at that but i'm not very much involved within it uh, i don't go kind of hunting for it but i know that this video did cause an absolute stir um on on the internet people believed it was someone that was dressed up people believed that it was legitimate um you know i think the uh the jury's still out on that one but take a look at the vid video that follows i don't believe in bigfoot but there is one photo that almost convinces me. This is the Mayaka skunk ape. It was taken right on the border of a national park, which is the most likely place that these things could exist. Even more interesting is the people who reported this didn't even call it a Bigfoot or a skunk ape. They thought it was an escaped orangutan, but clearly it isn't. Now, I know that this caused a huge stir with people saying that this was Bigfoot. This is, I think, being identified as some kind of ape. They did say at the beginning of the video, I've completely forgotten, but let's, let's watch on. If this is a hoax, I gotta say it's one of the best I've ever seen. Because I have no explanation for what this could be. Please, let me know what your theories are in the comments. Now, obviously, it could just be a hoax. It could just be, again, someone dressed up. But it's, uh, what was it? A Makaka Skunk Ape. Let me have a little look. Mayaka Skunk Ape. Now, that's, from what I remember, I don't believe the Mayaka Skunk Ape, I think that was an actual name given to this specific photo. Like, because that was kind of its closest supposed relative. For one of a better term, it was basically how it was identified, if that makes sense. But there is no... No actual proof that this is a Mayaka skunk ape and there is no proof that it's a Bigfoot either. It's just people saw it and were like no that's a Mayaka skunk ape because it looks like one. But the jury like I say is still out even on this one. What do you think of it? There is one more clip that I wanted to show you which again still to this day absolutely baffles me. It's only six seconds long and it's very very easy to miss. So you've got to kind of look around the um where, where the pines are and you'll kind of notice a bit of motion. Now, obviously, I'll play it again, um, but the noise at the beginning or throughout the clip does kind of link back to that video we showed earlier with the very strange noise with the guy in the mushrooms, but play it one more time. So, that's what I've got for you, really. Um, some very, what professionals are saying is very, uh, you know, compelling evidence of Bigfoot and Sasquatches. Would I say that? I don't know, personally. I know, but I want to hear your thoughts and opinions on it down below in the comments. Do you believe in Bigfoot? Do you think there is better evidence out there? If you know of any better evidence, you've caught better evidence, you've, you know, seen it somewhere, be sure to send it over to me and we'll take another deep dive into the, the Bigfoot Sasquatch mystery. Um, but I'd love to hear your thoughts and opinions down in the comments, ultimately. And uh, while you're down there, be sure to jump to get the hell out of that like button. If you have enjoyed, subscribe. If you are new and tickle my little bell so you get notified whenever we upload. And until next time, guys, I hope that you have enjoyed Cannot wait to see you in the next one and we'll speak to you later.